Hello everybody, Greg from Jimmy Joom. Very excited to show you Crane Game version 4.0. There's a lot, so I'm gonna, this probably gonna be a long video, but let's just show the basics right now. Okay, kinda same old crane. Twenty points. Okay, added to my total. You could see the gray outline. So that was a common that was a common fox. Common summer fox, I think it was. Let's try one more. Okay, that's a green outline, so I believe that is uncommon. So we get a little bit of a bonus. So an uncommon summer turtle for 29 points. Okay, adds it to my total. I want to see my last. There we go. There's my last six pulls. Has the point total. And then here's my top six. We have a leaderboard. So it has the all-time leaderboard. The points save across all streams so it's saving it on your stream elements account so it's all there and it shows you the session so in this session i'm the only one to go so that's kind of it point system uh rarity system and then you get to see your pulls and the leaderboard but there's a lot to it so i'm gonna be uh i'm gonna be talking a lot okay so I'll explain how the point system works. We have three items here. In the real game, we have 50 items. So it's a pool of items. This pool of items is going to get chosen randomly. Each item has the same amount of uh, odds or probability of being chosen. This one is just completely randomly selected. Your, uh, the item is going to have a value. So let's say we, it randomly picks the tire. Tires worth two points. The rarity system, I stole it from Borderlands. If you ever played that game, Borderlands. So we have common, uncommon, rare, epic, legendary, legendary mid, I called it, legendary high, and then I didn't do Pearl Lesson. I think it's mythic. The last one is mythic, and I only got it one time, so it's very difficult to get. Uh, but that's what the color outline is. So on the item, you'll see this color outline. And this is how the points work. So it's the base score, the base value of the item, times the multiplier, plus the bonus. And when you pick it up and the, the, uh, the bear holds it up, you'll see. That's what that little... You see the numbers, and then they come together, and they add together, and then they go down, and they add it to your total score. Uh, and this is the weighted part. So the items, pool of items... Completely random. This part is weighted rarity where pearlescent or mythic, as I called it, is very, very difficult to get. I only saw it one time. Legendary high is very difficult to get. And then you'll see lots of commons, lots of uncommons. Uh, you know, it gets more rare. You get the idea. Okay, so right away, this is the reminder system. Crane game. Crane game to play, follow to play, redeem crane game to play. That's uh, channel points. So let me show you those first. Trigger settings. So right now I have it trigger on chat, trigger on follow. And if I take these away, you'll see that this updates. The reminder system updates. So now command crane game to play and that's it. Because that's the only one I have set if i trigger on subs it will update here i tried to make this the reminder system less annoying i know it was kind of annoying in the last one so there we go subscribe to play uh that will come out right now i have it set to come out every seven minutes it will only come out if there's nothing else on the screen so like if someone's playing the game or someone's using the leaderboard or someone's checking their last six pulls that reminder won't come out. If anything, all, anything crane game is on the screen, that reminder will st stay away. Uh, if you don't want it at all, just put it on zero. 
and it, it's gone. Okay. Uh, commands. Let's we'll start at the top. So we have a show leaderboard command. I made it leaders, not leaderboard, because leaderboard is a seems to be a stream elements command. You can make it whatever you want. There we go. All time. And then it'll show the session. Since I just refreshed, no one went the session. Goes away. Show my last polls. My polls. All right. So you see the last six and you see the top six and you saw the images change real quick. There's a lot of images. It's there's a lot of loading. So the first time the image is seen, it might do that. But once it gets going, it's good. OK, you can play for a viewer. So if you're the streamer or a mod, you can play for someone. So there's no queue system. So say someone like uh, donates someone's already playing the game, they miss the cooldown, there's still a cooldown like before. So say, well, for whatever reason, someone misses their turn. They did something that should give them a turn and they didn't get it. This will let you fulfill that thing. I could, I, maybe, I'll, I, I don't know, a queue system, I, we'll see. But for now, this is how, like, let's say, um, Peter, one, two, three, four, five, Let's say he followed, but there was something going on and his follow didn't go through. Uh, you can do the command, which is pull and then a dash. So whatever your command is, it's going to be a dash and then the username. So I just did pull dash. That makes more sense. Okay. So I did pull dash Peter one, two, three, four, five. And that gave Peter one, two, three, four, five a go. He should be on here for the session. Oh, there he's number nine. Yeah, so you can use this to pull for um, viewers. Uh, this is the trigger settings. We kind of went through that. So you can trigger on chat if yes. What's the command for that? Trigger on follow, trigger on subs. Channel point redemption. So the channel point, the way it works is you're going to make your own channel point. You're going to call it something, whatever you want. Let's say you call it crane game. Then you're going to take that name and you're going to put it right here. Exactly. The name has to be exact. So say you called it crane game. Uh, this is just for testing because I don't, I don't have channel point rewards on mine. So I, I need a way to test it. So there we go. Channel point redemption. I think it's going to be example user. Yeah. A rare summer turtle. Trigger on donations. Okay. Donation amount. So now I've changed it to an exact amount. So donations, you put whatever you want. Uh, 50 cents, $1, whatever it is. Same with cheers. You have to cheer in exact amount for the game to be played. And it will say that on the reminders. So here we go. This I turned on donations. Donate one dollar to play. You can use your currency symbol too. Cheers. Okay. Other settings. Uh, there's many different color schemes. So let's go wooden orange. And you can see the color up here has changed already. So all the things, uh, it's easiest to see on the leaderboard, but they all, oh, that's a lot of points. Legendary mid Christmas pig. Uh, I'll show you one more. Let's do far screen. Okay. You get the idea. And the first three, there'll always be gold, silver, and bronze drop percentage. You can change. You can make it so the, the crane drops. All right, so right now I have it set to zero and it's never gonna drop. The highest you can go is 50%. All right, there's a drop. So up to you. If you don't like the drop feature, you can turn it off. 
The reminder, we went over that already. This is in minutes. Cooldown. So the cooldown still exists. 15 seconds is kind of, it's the lowest. Um, if you keep it at 15, it's kind of like you can go back to back to back. Um, but if you want a longer cooldown, you can you can do that too. Sound, you can do the volume. I, there's a couple more sounds than before. Stream elements bot settings. Okay. Uh, so do the the debated token in the same way as before. And now you can use these little keywords. So it's the the curly brackets. User will be the person's name. Rarity is common, uncommon, epic, rare, legendary, that stuff. Item is the name of the item. Worth, points is the number, the total points, and yeah. So you can use those little um, tags to customize your message. There's 50 items. So you're gonna come in here. You can change anything you want. I, I did it um, from low value to high value. So items 1 through 10, they're all, it's like a boot, an old boot, 1 point, an old tire, 1 point, a plastic bag, 2 points, a fox head, 3 points, pig head, 3, 3, 3, Sour Patch Kids, 4. <laughs> Not valuable. And then the end, you can use uh, GIFs. Gifts will work, but nah, I wouldn't go too many because there's a lot of images. There's a lot going on in here. I originally, I tried having lots of gifts and it was, used a lot of memory. It was very slow. Uh, so the Fighting Shark, 65. Piggy Bob Ross, 70. Yellow Card, 75. Grandpa, 80. 80. Kirby, 85. Fighting Turtle, 100. Yeah, so up to you. You can leave all that stuff. You can change it. And that's kind of it for version 4.0. Um, I really like where it's at. I, I found myself playing, kind of getting addicted to picking up things and seeing what, seeing if I could get a, a legendary one. It's kind of fun. And I, yeah, I like where it's at. Um, I'm going to send it out. I'm going to... I have some plans after this to, you know, update, but I want to hear what everyone has to say. I want to see if there's something I missed, something I just didn't even think about. So I want to get it out to people. I want to see your opinions. And yeah, um, you should be getting a message within the next few days. If you see this and you didn't get a message and you bought it and you really want it, Message me on Etsy, and I'll just send it. I'll send it to you. Hopefully, this gives your chat a little more incentive to play, and I think it does. Uh, so, thank you, and I hope you enjoy it.